to Skidoo Soundbites. Today we're going to be showing you that the impossible can be possible. And to do that we've got my friend here, Lachlan. Hi Lachlan. Hi everyone. Okay, so what we've got today, Lachlan, to show you that the impossible can sometimes be possible, we have, of course, to demonstrate this, what would you expect other than a banana. Okay, Lachlan, um, have you ever seen this banana before? No. Okay, can you take the banana and I want you to check and make sure that I haven't done anything weird to it. It's a normal, is it a real banana? It's not false or fake. I haven't done anything strange to it. Give it a good look over. No, it's a normal banana. It's a normal banana. Okay, now this banana, okay, bananas are great foods, aren't they? Have you ever heard that? Do you know what they're good for? No. no they've kind of got potassium and manganese and vitamins and minerals and who knows what in them. But they're kind of like the perfect food because when you buy them in the shop, you don't have to wash them because you can just unpeel them and eat them. So they're really great. Do you like bananas? Yes. Good, because you're going to eat this at the end, okay? Now, the only better thing about bananas are, you know if you make a fruit salad, well, you've got to chop them all up. So I thought, how cool would it be if we could actually use your special karate powers to chop up the banana without opening it? So that when you opened a banana, it was already in pieces. Do you think that's possible? No. Are you sure? You don't think you can do that? No. I have faith in you, Lachlan. I believe that Lachlan can do this. Okay, Lachlan, how long did you do karate for? Three years. Three years. So look at the skills. Okay. So what I want you to do, I'm going to hold the banana. I don't want you to touch it or interact with it, but I want you, have you got like a special karate chop you do? Yeah. Cool. I want you to like do, let's say, five karate chops in the air and hope that you can use your powers to break the sound waves so the sound waves hit the banana, slice all the way through without breaking it. Okay? So I'm going to hold it up, and I want you to do five imaginary, without touching them, karate chops to try, and I want you to concentrate on slicing the banana inside. Can you do that? I'm not, I'm not don't, don't hit it. Just, just go close to it, but don't hit it, whatever you do. Okay, yeah? One, two, don't hit it, three, four, five. Okay, did you feel it do anything? No. No, you don't look <laughs> too impressed. Would you like to open the banana and see if the impossible can be possible? Okay, so tell me something about this banana. Do you want to hold it up so everyone can see? What's happened? It has marks in it. Marks in it. Okay, open the banana and let's see. Did you cut it up into pieces ready for the fruit salad? Yes. You did. Show everyone. Okay, so can you give me a piece so you can show people? Okay, so there's a piece. Pull off another piece. So it's already cut up even though that banana was completely normal, wasn't it? Yeah. And do you know what? This is a great way to teach young people that although sometimes things about God and about Jesus and in the Bible seem impossible, they do, don't they? Some yeah. things you read and you think, that can't be possible. Okay, but there's a great Bible verse, look at this, there's a great Bible verse in Matthew, in chapter 19, in verse 26, and Jesus is talking to his friends and he says, there are some things that people can't do, but God can do anything. God can do the impossible. And this trick shows us that the impossible is sometimes possible. You didn't expect that, did you? No. <laughs> okay, do you want to know how I did it? Yeah. Here? Okay. Big secret here. Don't tell everyone. What you need is an ordinary banana. Okay? And then you need a very ordinary pin. Do you know what I'm going to do with it? No. You don't know. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stick the pin into one of the black pieces on the banana. And I'm going to push the pin in. But I'm not going to let it come out the other side. And then I'm going to swivel the pin around inside the banana. Until I think I've cut through the whole banana. Okay, and then I just go up a little bit further. Do you want to do one for me? Do one near the top. Now, I don't tell the children that I do this trick with how to do it because I think that spoils um, and I love them to be left in anticipation and suspense. But for you today, I'm giving away all my tricks. Okay, can you feel it going inside, Lachlan, and going yeah. side to side? Okay, so do you want to open this banana and see if it's worked? And of course it looks like an ordinary banana. Any child that picks it up won't see that you've done a thing to it because all you've done is a tiny little pin hole. Okay? Show everyone? Yeah, so there's your very first piece. I did one right at the bottom. Do you want to open it up, see if the bottom one is done? It's a really great way to show children that the impossible can sometimes be possible. Fantastic. Thanks, Lockton, for helping me today. Thanks for watching us today on Skidoo Soundbites.